what the dream should say. I think we spend a lot of time managing the present because of what it will bring in the future. When the future arrives, it is never what we imagined it would, it would be. How could it be? We're not time travelers. We don't know. We imagine things, events, places, people, jobs, babies. We imagine that these will make us feel happy. So we feel satisfied doing the things that are keeping us on our way to getting the next things. But when we get to the next thing, it doesn't come with the feeling we imagined we would get. We need to find the feeling. And the feeling is always available to us. It's available to me in my lying on my back shift between lying on my side and doing my stretches. It's available in every instant. It is also not available in any instant unless we bring ourselves there. Some things jump out at us so loudly that they break through, even if we aren't ready. Aurora Borealis, maybe. I wonder how many people see Aurora Borealis and instead of feeling the joy, are thinking about their cold feet, whether their partner loves them, or how annoying a nearby person is. No, not possible. Aurora Borealis must take over. But very few things take over and make us enjoy the thing we've got. How desperate was I to be mother, and how many times did I not find the joy in mothering? Tired of the tuck-in, the feeding, the diapers? This thing that was the greatest thing also sometimes was not. I feel that I can get to a state of enjoying all the things. That doesn't mean not crying through the pain. And some of the things are going to be pain and loss and feel too hard. But I feel that I can get to a state of enjoying more of the things by trusting that it will be okay. Not easy, but okay. By living in the moment, not in my story of the moment, not in my dream of the future. Oh, the stories of the moments. Each moment has such history. There are places I used to pass with my ex and every time I would tell him the same story of what had happened there until he taught me not to. But the stories of those places still came to my mind. Layers upon layers for every place, every person, every role, every responsibility, so much context. But when I drop away the context and just be present in the moment, I feel something different. It's not to say I can't have memory. I am often surprised by the memories that come to me seemingly unattached to anything in my nearby periphery. Why at that moment? And to let my mind experience the current moment, allowing memories to come and thoughts of the future to come, but to let them go and not let them tangle up the current moment, which desires only to be free and whole in and of itself, unencumbered by the invasion of things that do not exist, and take away the capacity of the moment to communicate its beauty, which is as great as Aurora Borealis, but requires a gentler attention. To be seen. Yes, the beauty of Aurora Borealis is in every moment. I do not need to be a beauty whisperer. I only need to listen to the whisper of the beauty. The future, the dreams I am working on, those are fun and good and I should continue. But that is planning, envisioning, right here, right now. Beauty is whispering to me with all the greatness of Aurora Borealis saying, if you feel me, I will be in this moment with you. And the next time you remember this moment, you will remember me. Those dreams of the future, they have whispers too. Sometimes they whisper that now is not good enough. They whisper that I need something else. They whisper, don't be here. This place is no good. Close your eyes, shut your ears, hold your breath. You can barely survive this horrible time. Get to the future, go, go. You do not want to be here now. I must not get so lost in my vision of what I need for my future. For when the future comes, I will still be lost. Perhaps I will have a new vision, new dream whispers. But the dream whispers need to change, or they will always be the same. They need to say, good is now, and good is later. Good is every time. 
This dream is beautiful, and the things you are doing now are connected to it. We don't know how the dream will come to pass or if it will come to pass, but keep listening to those dreams as you navigate today. When something sings with the song of the dream, go that way. Enjoy going that way. You are already living the dream. Everything is already perfect. The dream is just helping you continue your path and choose each moment. Choose beauty. Beauty is the dream, and the dream is beauty. As soon as you decide to feel the beauty around you now, you will begin to enjoy each moment for what it currently is, the unplanned, unpredictable, wild beauty of it. And you will cease to be surviving until you get to the next thing, telling yourself that then you will feel the beauty. You will realize that you are already here. The beauty is already with you. That is what the dream should say. <laughs>